welcome to vlog number two very exciting i hope you loved my new intro i've got a new banner um, I've got a new logo, um, a new outro, so yeah, this is all very exciting. I used the same person that I use for my main channel, animations and things, so if you want to know who I use, just let me know down below and I'll, um, I'll let you know who I use. So yeah, it was very affordable, it was like £30 for all of that and some UK companies and things charge so much just for like an intro so yeah I thought that was a really good deal sorry about all the crap you can see in the background but anyways today is a very very exciting day because guess what come in the post today my new camera oh my god I'm literally I'm so excited so I ended up getting a new camera um I still have my 70D I've just got to sell that um for part either for parts or if people want to repair it i'm not really too sure but i do need to sell that now um but i've got the canon 250d now this actually films in 4k and this is completely brand new the canon i had before i bought that well my mum and dad bought that for me second hand for christmas um and i just thought do you know what we're just going to go for a brand new camera i'm going to be completely transparent my mum and dad actually did buy this for me because it's my birthday on the 6th of august and my plan was to sell the canon 70d and put the money towards like a new camera i might have got got the like canon g7 x mark ii because that was slightly more affordable whereas this is just a little bit more expensive um but my mum and dad really wanted to buy it for me for my birthday so you know I couldn't say no to that and i'm super super lucky and grateful um so yeah this is my birthday present oh, i'm literally so excited it films in 4k um it's really good quality it's much smaller and very much lighter than the 70d so this is going to be fun um also the tech on it is not as much as the 70d there's a lot less buttons and things but i think that's because it's slightly smaller um it's got a new like lens on it and things so yeah i'm very excited about this new camera and that is why today is very exciting um i can't wait to start using it i'm probably gonna start using it tonight um yeah oh my goodness i can't wait so yeah i'm just so lucky i'm so grateful you have no idea um so yeah that's very very exciting apart from that not really much going on i i'm trying to work on myself personally um trigger warning for any like weight loss or anything like that if you don't like to talk about that kind of stuff then just skip ahead but i weighed myself over a week ago and let's just say i wasn't happy with how much i weighed and now me and my mum are on like a proper diet we're exercising maybe three times a week and we're just working on our eating our like worst things like portion sizes and stuff so we're cutting down i'm um, making sure i'm eating through instead of like normal snacks and things like that so i'm not being like super duper strict on myself but i kind of am a little bit as well because i do want to lose some weight you know so that's kind of what's going on personally youtube wise today i've literally just hit 6.8k which is insane I'm 200 away from 7k i can't believe it um i really hope i can hit that in august if i have like any sort of chance of hitting 10k by the end of this year um yeah that's insane i can't wait and i've literally already started collecting for my 10k giveaway pile how insane is that i just thought i've got some really exciting bits coming in um i picked up like all four of the p louise metallic bases like 15 pounds i was like yeah i'm gonna get that i've got hooder in there i've got loads of p louise in there actually i've got ilamasca product um, and i'm just gonna keep collecting and collecting and by the time i hit 10k i'll have like a huge amount of prizes to give away so yeah that's very exciting obviously 10k's got to be super special so i'm collecting loads of good bits for that do you like my hair because i don't it looks absolutely terrible but i saw this um hack on tiktok last night where if you're not good at doing french plaits the hack is to like take one strand and another strand and like twist it round instead of plaiting it like just twist it around each other and then get to the bottom and plait it didn't work very well but it's literally my first attempt so yeah anyway we move so that's kind of where i'm at at the moment i'm gonna definitely start filming on the new camera tonight and i'll let you know how it goes i think i'm gonna start editing on adobe premiere pro again i used to edit on adobe premiere pro when i had 
my laptop before but when I got my um, MacBook Pro laptop I was like I'm just going to go to iMovie because it's just so much more simpler but the problem with it being so simple is that there's not really much you can do with it there's literally just the very basic editing tools I can't overlay too many things and it's just a lot better on Adobe Premiere Pro and because that shoots in 4K as well I think it'll be a little bit easier to actually edit that on Premiere Pro I don't know, I'm not really much of a tech person, but yeah, Frank's got the, um, what's it called, subscription for his PC, as you can see, um, so I'm just going to download it onto my computer and start doing that, but yeah, that's pretty much where I'm at at the moment, um, you know, not really much happening this week, so this is going to be like a really chilled one i i am reading your comments and i am definitely going to start picking up the camera and actually taking it places rather than just sitting here and talking i know it can be a bit boring but yeah there's really not much going on i'm going to get my nails done this week i might go primark this week and get some like a full phase of new makeup so i'll take you along to that um but yeah that's pretty much it so i'll see you in the next vlog clip now for today's video i have another try on haul for you I have had this bag sitting in my room for about, mm, I don't know, five weeks now. Just been chilling in my room, you know. I've just been meaning to sit down and film this, but I honestly just haven't got round to it. So today, guys, we are going to be doing a huge try on sheen haul hello so it's much later on in the evening now i redid my hair because it looked absolutely awful i've sat down and i've started filming feels so good to be on my new camera i'm not gonna lie i literally i'm so happy with it it's not even funny um so i've just filmed with the sigma glow kissed highlighter palette I mean, it speaks for itself. It's absolutely beautiful. I also filmed an unboxing of the Unicorn Cosmetics 25 pound mystery box. And right now I'm filming a sheen haul. So I thought I'd do a few um, videos. I thought I'd bulk film a little bit um, just because my auntie and her partner and my cousins are coming down this weekend. So I wanna get my filming complete all like this week and then the weekend I can have it completely off. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna film my sheen haul um, and then I'll check in with you when there's something else to update you on. Hello, so it's the next day now. I finished filming yesterday. I actually filmed three videos, which is really good. It's Wednesday. Work's not really that busy today, to be honest with you. Um, so I've got my nail appointment now. I'm actually sat outside waiting to go in, getting rid of these. Um, I'm going to get some birthday nails done, because obviously my birthday next week, oh, which is really exciting. I'm obviously going to go pink, but I don't know. These sound a bit more fancy, don't we? So we'll see what they look like. Um, but yeah that's kind of an update for a minute i am actually going shopping later with one of my friends i'm going primark because i'm gonna get a full face of new primark makeup and do like a, a new like testing full face of primark video um but yeah i'll kind of update you with that later on but so yeah i'm just getting my nails done so say goodbye to these nails hello so i'm back it's been just over an hour and these are my nails i've got pink and then just like a line of rose gold glitter in it but um yeah so i've just had my nails done i'm gonna drive back home now it is lunch time so i'm probably gonna make some lunch when i get back um and then i don't think i'm filming tonight as i say i'm going shopping with my friend um so next time i talk to you i'll probably be just about to leave for shopping so yeah so next time my speeches will probably be when i actually go shopping so i'll update you and i'll show you what everything that i buy at shopping as well so that'll be fun hello so it's much later now as you can see and probably here it's absolutely bucking it down outside um i completely forgot to film when i left to go shopping because i was like running super late um and then i didn't vlog when i got there because i'm very awkward vlogging in public places i'm not gonna lie <laughs> sorry about that um but i do have i do have my full face of primate makeup which is so exciting um i'm definitely going to do a little haul for you guys and um, i don't even know if the video will be up by the time you're watching this um i don't know when i'm going to be able to film it yet um but i did get some new bits there's a couple of new collections i've bought from um and yeah i'll get inside now i just wanted to mix up the background you know what i mean it's a bit boring always seeing me in the bedroom but yeah so i'm now home um it's absolutely bucketing down it was so horrible to drive home in like I'm not like an anxious driver, I'm fine driving, but when it's like bucking it down like this, I just get really nervous um, about driving in it because my car was literally like sliding a little bit and I was just like, oh my God, this is not good. But anyways, I'm gonna go inside now, 
um i'll settle in and then i'll quickly do a little primark haul for you um and then love island time oh i'm so excited there's so much drama going on at the moment i love a bit of drama i love reality tv um and yeah the boys are in casa and more at the minute so a lot is going down but yeah i'm gonna go inside and then i'll show you my primark haul okay i'm back in the house now um out of the rain i can't believe how bad the rain is today or this week last week it was like heat wave this week chucking it down rain excuse the state of myself and my hair i obviously don't care what i look like when i go out anyways little primark haul my friend accent left her purse in here so that's a good start um but yeah i just bought a full face of primark makeup and it cost 39 pound 50 for a full face that's really good um i did get two of the same thing because i know a sausage was after the new serum blushes that they've got out so i bought an extra one so i can post it to her um but let's have a little look so firstly i bought uh this ps pro long wear radiant matte foundation don't know how a foundation can be long wear radiant and matte um, but I'm pretty sure this launched, well, actually, to be fair, I don't know if this launched first lockdown or if this is super new. I actually don't know. Um, but this is a medium buildable coverage. I got the shade 111 Cool. No idea if that's going to suit me, but that was £6. Then I bought the, like, matching concealer. This might be a little bit too dark for me, but it was the lightest one they had available. This is the Radiant Under Eye Concealer, which could be a good dupe of the NARS concealer. And this cost £3.50 and I got it in the shade 121 Cool. Um, what else we got? Okay, so same range as that. This is the Natural Finish Flawless Powder Foundation or Powder and Foundation. Again, 111 Cool. This is £5. This is what the packaging looks like. And then it's just like a um, just like a powder foundation like this. I love the one they brought out before, so I wonder if that's just the same formula. Um, I picked up a bronzer. This is the Luminous Sheer Glow and Finishing Powder in 513 Dark. I think this is just like a normal powder, but I just bought it as a bronzer. Um, and this was £4. So Primark are slightly up in their prices, I think. Um, their powder, I'm pretty sure their old foundation powder was £2.50. And this one is £5. So they've like doubled their price. There was no contour products. Um, but I picked up a liquid blush. This is the one I was talking about. This is the new... They have this like whole range i don't really know what the range is called it's kind of like a natural range i don't know they had loads of different bits but i just picked a couple um this is three euros 50 i don't know how much that is in english in english in um pounds but this is called a pro skin barrier cheek tint so it's just like a serum -y blush um so instead of a powder blush i have a um liquid blush um yeah i don't really know this was a whole range but that was yeah three euros 50 highlighters there wasn't really much in i picked up one of these however it's really dark um so this is the new pearl highlighter it's three pounds but look at that that's the lightest shade and it just has i don't know if, how well you can see that but it has like a very light shade and then it goes into like a yellow gold don't know if i have to get away with that but we'll definitely see in that video I picked up one of their new sprays, which is the same range as that sheer blush. This is the Vit Fix Vitamin Rich Priming Mist. It's a priming mist, but I'll just use it as a normal spray. That's what the packaging looks like. And this costs £3.50, um, so not too bad. I had to pick up an eyeshadow palette, so I just picked up one of these little nine pads that they used to do. The old ones used to be in like really basic black packaging, but they've upped the packaging with these ones, and I had to get this one. I feel like mint eyeshadow is like in at the moment. This is the PS Sweet Mint eyeshadow palette, and this was three pounds. How gorgeous is that palette? Oh my goodness. It looks unreal, and there's actually like five mattes in here, and the rest shimmers very happy with that so cheap as well i picked up again um a product that was part of the um blush and spray range this is the 38 degree conditioning mascara i mean i hope that's a problem mascara because i didn't actually check obviously i haven't opened it um but i think all product makeup is cruelty free which is really good oh even the palette is cruelty free and vegan and then the last thing that i managed to pick up i've already got brow stuff 
um so i just picked up some lip stuff because i don't really have any new brow stuff so i just will use the pencil i've already got in my collection and um, but i did pick up one of these little lip kits this is the ps contour lip kit i don't know what shade oh the toffee edit has a little lip liner and then two liquid lipsticks and then yeah as i said i picked up another little blush for why make me up this is patrons because i hate people missing out on things and um she asked in the group chat if anyone would get one for her and i was in there so i got it so that was my primark haul um tonight i don't know i've already edited my videos like, in advance tonight i'm not really doing much i've already edited like two videos so i'm like well ahead with editing oh i do need to sort out today's video actually which is the i Heart revolution pistachio palette review so i'll sort that out in a second when i come off of here um but this morning the new xx revolution range launched i can i don't know what the name of it is but it's like an orange theme so there's like an orange palette there's um a primer there's a mascara like a, a serum like lash and brow serum um there's also lip oils um i think that's it i picked up the palette the primer and the lip oil from boots on three for two because for some reason didn't come on beauty bay today which is really odd um and i completely forgot that i was going shopping today so i would have got it in store today if i had my head screwed on properly but obviously don't so i've got to wait for that to be um ready for collection i think it's friday i'm hoping it will come early and come tomorrow because i can get the review up tomorrow and send and get it up early um but it doesn't matter you guys will watch my videos if you enjoy them so um yeah i'm not too fussed on that so yeah that's pretty much it for today um i'm just gonna sort out tonight's video and then love island's on so that is that is me for this wednesday evening and like quick like, little side note obviously i filmed for the first time on my new camera yesterday and i'm literally so in love with it like the quality is just unreal and the way it like focuses and unfocuses like if you watch a new main channel video the way like the camera like lens moves forward and then backwards i don't know i'm just obsessed with it i'm so so happy i'm literally so super lucky and grateful that i got that for my birthday and i'm just yeah i absolutely love it so that is me done for this wednesday i will check in with you tomorrow because i don't i don't actually think i've got much going on but i'll check in with you tomorrow anyway hello so it's actually a couple days later i believe um basically yesterday was thursday didn't really do anything at all i had like a proper chilled night because i don't know if anyone else is like this but when i'm a, like productive i'm either super productive or like not productive at all so yesterday was like, a complete chill day today is friday um i'm actually just about to review the new xx collection i can never i can never remember the name of it but it's the orange collection i got the primer palette and lip oil it did show up at the boot store today which is amazing which means i can get it up tonight i'm literally going to film it straight away edit and then obviously get it up tonight um I am getting the new Beauty Bay palette in PR, which is very exciting. So that video will be up at some point. And then this weekend, I'm super busy with family, so I'm probably going to round this video up tomorrow. Um, but yeah, that's kind of where I'm at at the moment. Not much going on. I'm just filming and making sure I'm editing and getting up for you guys. I've still got the Unicorn Cosmetics unboxing and my Sheen try on haul to upload, but my camera's going to die. Um, yes, yeah, so I just thought I'd quickly update you. Didn't do anything yesterday, and today I'm a bit more productive. Um, so yeah, I'll check in with you guys in a second. Okay, so I've just filmed my XX video. I have taken my lashes off, by the way, um, because I just find lashes so uncomfortable when I don't need to be wearing them. Um, so yeah, I've just filmed that. I'm literally... The race is on, guys. I need to edit it quickly before Love Island, um, and then I'll probably upload while Love Island is on, so it'll probably be up about 10-ish tonight. I don't like uploading super late, but when it's a new release, it like desperately needs to go up. Or sometimes I like forget about it and then like end up just uploading late anyway. But don't worry, guys. I'm sorry about it being up late. If any of my uploads are late, I do apologise. I don't do it on purpose. It's just sometimes, especially in cases like this where I've literally just got it today and it's a brand new release. Obviously, I, I work, so I can't film it during the day. So I made sure I filmed it straight after work. I did have McDonald's. 
so i ate that first and then i filmed and then i'm getting it up now but yeah this is my look obviously without the lashes um i'm obsessed if you love warm tones you're gonna absolutely love the palette like it's so beautiful so yeah i'm gonna go edit that now and prepare for love island tonight because it's recoupling like like the second lot of people coming back from casa Amor, which is just like really exciting um and i'll probably round up this vlog tomorrow to be honest um so yeah i'll check in with you guys tomorrow okay guys so it's a few days later i'm now on monday i was supposed to finish off the vlog on saturday but i completely forgot um i had such a lovely weekend um, with my family and uh, my auntie and her partner and her two kids come all the way down from scotland to come and have a little visit with us so that was absolutely lovely i did no filming whatsoever on the weekend just had a complete like family orientated weekend and it was so nice um but i am now going to end this vlog here because i want to start another one because i'm actually getting my hair done so you'll definitely see that in the next vlog um but yeah i'm gonna end this vlog here i really hope you enjoyed it i know i know it's not been the most like exciting one um but i have definitely gone got some bits done this week um and the next one will be up very soon so i really hope you enjoyed this video if you did definitely let me know by smashing the thumbs up button and i'll see you in my next vlog